Hi, Assalamu alaikum. With me again, Teacher Rin. In this video, we will learn Mathematics Form 2, Chapter 9, Speed and Acceleration, 9.1 Speed, and the learning standard is 9.1.2. Describe the differences between uniform and non uniform speed. Look at the movement of this ball in the diagram. Ball A and ball B are rolled on the table. The movement of the ball is described as follow. Here I show to you the distance time graph for ball A and ball B. You can see here the graph for ball A is like this and the graph for ball B will be like this. The form of the graph shows that ball A moves in uniform speed because the graph is in a straight line, while ball B is moving in a non-uniform speed. Okay, what is actually uniform speed? Uniform speed is the speed that covers equal distance in equal interval time while non-uniform speed is the speed that covers unequal distance in equal interval of time. Easily here, if you want to understand what is actually non-uniform and uniform speed, you just see you can analyze the speed of each of the time interval. Alright, for example, okay, for ball A, you can see in the first time interval, the first second, the ball is moving 2 cm. And for the another one second after that, also the ball is moving 2 cm and so on. While ball B does not show the same trait of moving. You can see here in the first one second, it moved 2 cm while in the second uh, interval time, okay, another one second, the ball moved 3 cm. So, it shows that the speed is not uniform. Why does we say that the speed is not uniform? Because we can determine the speed by looking at this graph. From distance time graph, it will show the speed of the object. Why? Because Speed is equals to distance divided by time. Okay, uh, I hope that you can understand what is uniform speed and non-uniform speed. Let us look at some example how to uh, determine whether the situation is uh, uniform speed or non-uniform speed. Okay, let's try. Okay, example one. Alpha drove a trailer for 170 km within the first 2 hours and 190 km within the next 4 hours. Did Alpha drive the trailer at a uniform speed? Okay, for this type of question, here are my advice. Okay, first of all, you must highlight what is the important information given here. For example, 100 km, 2 hours, 190 and 4 hours. So we just jot down what is given here, what are asked in the question. For example, here we need to find the speed. Okay, this is the first um, info that we get from the question. 170 kilometers for 2 hours and the second uh, information is 100 kilometers for 4 hours. Okay, for me this one, what you need to do is uh, label each of the information. The first one is 170 and 190 km is the distance where we put it as D. Alright, and 2 hours we put it as T. Uh, D is distance and T is for time. Okay, uh, what we need to find here is the speed. So I show again to you the triangle DST that I've uh, mentioned before in the previous video. Okay, what is D? D is distance, S is speed, and T is time. Okay, for this question, we need to find the 
speed. So how to find speed? We need to take distance and divide by time. So the speed for the first time interval, okay, for the first two hours is 85 kilometer per hour. While the second uh, time interval, which is the next four hours is 190 divided by four, which will give the value of 47.5 kilometer per hour. Here you can see the speed is not the same surely it shows that the speed of the trailer is non-uniform okay let's move on to example two here showing that a golfer is hitting the ball uh, from pole p to pole s passing through pole q and pole r for this type of question i advise to you to this to do like this okay uh you just put here d and then T and then S. What is D? D is distance. T is time and S is speed. Okay, for each time interval, for example here, uh, how many time interval? Okay, three, right? P, Q, Q, and then the second. The second one is Q, R, and then followed by uh, R, S. Okay, okay, so this is the time interval given. For the first part here, okay, uh, what is the distance? Okay, distance is 40 meter, right? And then two seconds is the time or speed? Okay, time, time, so we put it here, two seconds. Okay, the same as another part, okay, 7M and 3.5S, and then this one is 60M and three second all right so s is what s is distance divided by time so 40 divided by 2 the answer is sorry the answer is 20 meter per second okay and then the next part is okay we will get 20 meter per second and this one, 60 divided by 3, will equal to 20 meter per second. Okay, what can you see here? All the speed, okay, for each part is the same, right? Okay, so we can conclude that um, the speed, okay, okay, the speed, all right, of the golf ball, is what okay is uniform right so i hope that you can understand how to find whether the the speed is uniform or non-uniform okay okay so uh, i want you to remember this okay km per h is equals to km per h okay and then equals to km h uh, the power of negative one all right so all of this is the same so go, don't get confused if the question you get is uh, either one of the unit given here okay so i want to uh, give some conclusion before we stop uh, this video okay so what is uniform speed okay uniform speed is the speed that covers equal distance in equal interval time while non-uniform speed is uh, the speed that cover unequal distance in equal interval time okay hope that it can help you to understand what is uniform and non-uniform speed till we meet again in another video see you assalamualaikum and happy studying